Welcome viewers. Today I am going to discuss and explain a combination of yoga in Sudoku Classic. Combination of yoga are a set of numbers in the middle row or in the middle column of every block in Sudoku Classics. How do this combination behave when moving from one block to another block I shall explain it. In this grid we have 4, 3, 9 combination in the middle row. This is called a combination of yoke or we can say yoke combination. Similarly in the next block we have 6, 7, 5. Next block we have 1, 8, 2. 6, 7, 5, 9, 3, 4. 1, 8, 2, these are all combinations of yoke. Then in vertical columns, the middle column is again a combination of yoke. 2, 3, 6, 4, 7, 1, 6, 8, 9, 4, 2, 3, 6, these are all combinations of yoke. But how do they behave? When we shift these numbers to the next block, you will notice 439 gets bifurcated into two groups. One group of two, two numbers and the third one is the solo. 43 moves, 4 and 9 moves on the upper row and 3 moves in the lower row. Similarly, 675, we have a combination of 6 and 5 moves on the upper row and 7 moves in the seven row, lower row. Similarly, one, eight, uh, 9, 3, 4, we get 4 and 9 on the upper row and 3 in the lower row. If we think of the columns, 2, 3, 6, 2 and 6 gets bifurcated into one side and 3 into one side. Similarly, 2, 3, 5, we get 2, 5 on one side and 3 on one side. But there is an exception. This is valid for each and every Sudoku classic. But approximately 0.1%, may say 1%, this rule will not apply. I will explain in that grid. In this type of grid, this yoke combination is not applicable. Why? Because we have 8, 4, 2 in this sequence. Similarly, 8, 4, 2 in the same sequence. 8, 4, 2 in the same sequence. Again, 3, 6, 7, 3, 6, 7, 3, 6, 7, 1, 9, 5, 1, 9, 5, 2, 8, 4, 2, 8, 4. All the top, all the rows, they have the similar sequence. So this rule of your combination will not be applicable to this type of rigs, sorry, grids. This rule will not be applicable to this type of grids. This combination, this combination is very effective and useful tool for solving the Sudoku puzzles. A stage comes when we solve this Sudoku that we have number of multiple choice of numbers in same cell. I shall explain it to you how it is useful and effective by a practical example. In this grid, what we have 1, 8, 2 is a combination of yoke. I have, I have explained the movement of these numbers into this next, cell, next block highlighted by blue colors. 2, 1, will go up and 8 will go down. On this side, 2, 1 will go down and 8 will come up. So this is the general pattern of behavior for all these combinations. In this example, we have reached a stage that each and every unoccupied cell has multiple choice of numbers. For example, on the top row, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 columns, 5 cells unoccupied. 
we have a multiple choice of 5 and 6 here and 5 and 6 here. 1 to 8 here, 1 to 8 here, 1 to here. Similarly, in the next row, we have 4, 9 and 4, 9. In this row, we have 6, 9, 1, 6, 1, 9, 6. And in this row, we again have 3 unoccupied cells where the multiple choice is 6, 5, 4, 5, 6 and 4, 5. Similarly, again, we have 3 unoccupied cells, 2 and 2, 9, 9, 5. 5656, 256, 256, 196, 191, like that. So I will try to solve it by using a principle of combination of yoke. How do if we scan the puzzle properly? We will find that we have one here, one here, and three is already fixed. So what will happen, we have 1, 9, 3, if we bifurcate this combination into two parts, we get 1, 3 here and 9 here. Effectively we mean that 1 and 3 will go up and 9 will have no choice except to come down. So we have 9 here, 9 here, we will eliminate 9 from here and we will get 9 here. If we get 9 here, we get 2 here. Nine and two. So if we get nine here, so we eliminate this nine from here, and we get nine in the top set. Nine. If we get nine here, we get six here. and 5 here. If we get 6 here, this 6 gets eliminated from this. We get 5 here. If we have 5 here, we eliminate 5 from this place and we get 6 here. Now if we get 6 here, we eliminate 6 from here and we get 6 here. And 5 remains in this set. So if we get 5 here, what we do? We eliminate 5 from this, these two cells. We get 2 and 2, 6. So 6 we can't get here. 6 and 6. 6 we cannot get here. 6 we cannot have here. We eliminate 6 from here also. And 6 here also. We get 6 here. And 2 here. We get 6 here. And 2 here. So if we go top. 2 here. 2 here. 2 will come in the center cell. 2. So now what we have? 1, 8 here. 8 we can't have here. So 8 will not be here. So we will remove 8 from here. 8 will come here. And 1, one will remain here. If we have one here, so we can't have one here, one gets eliminated from this, this cell and remains nine here. So we, one will come here. If we get one here, one will get eliminated from this and we will have six only here and one will remain here. If we have nine here, so nine, this nine will get eliminated, what will be left is four. 
and from here 4 will get eliminated but we will have 9 here. So if we have 4 here, 4 will get eliminated, we will have 5 here. We will get 1, 2, 3, 4 here. So we, if we have 8, 8 is eliminated from here, we are left with 5 and from here we will get 5 eliminated and we are left with 8. So friends, this is the way we are able to solve with the use of 1, 9, 3, your combination. What happened? 1 and 3 has gone there and 9 will come down. This was the key. Once they, we get the 9 here, every puzzle can be solved easily. Friends, I hope I have explained properly in detail the use and effectiveness of combination of yoke. If you feel this is of use to you, please subscribe, share, comment and like. Thank you very much.